morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Mr. Stewart. Oh, good morning. Why don't we just start at the beginning? Page one. Open your book. Where do babies come from? If you need me, I'll be right over here. Well, we need this uh, for the exam. The parts of a flower are so constructed that very, very often the wind will cause pollination. If not, then a bee or any other nectar-gathering creature can create the same situation. Yes, anything that gets the pollen to the pistols right on the list. I'll try to make it crystal clear. A flower's insatiable passion turns its life into a circus of debauchery. Now you see just how the stamen gets its lusty dust onto the stigma. And why this frenzied chlorophyllous orgy starchy spring is no enigma. We call this quest for satisfaction a what, class? A photoperiodic reaction! Oh, that's good. Oh, that's very good. Hey, I'm lost. Where are we? Chapter two. Page five. Reproduction. Reproduction. Put your pollen tube to work. Reproduction. Reproduction. Make my staining go berserk. Reproduction. Got your pistol right here. Where does the ball in? Back here. Would you get in your seat? Right here. Right here. Ah -ha. Woo. Sit down. Next chapter. Now, in an abstract way, the same thing applies to the reproductive organs of the more complex life forms. But we are now dealing with sexual response. <laughs> are there any questions before we begin reading? Is it possible the female member of some sex on a couch could, like, get this guy all hot oh. and she never even knew it? Negative. When a warm-blooded mammal in a tight little sweater starts pulling that stuff, She's saying that she wants to do it. Oh, yeah. Can't prove it by me. Cause they change the tune when you got them in the backseat. With this heart beating fast. They make it sound like a track being gross. Yeah, then all they can do is say, no, 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 no. Controlling its number of offspring. Uh, are there any comments on that? Yeah, I was wondering if you could tell me where she lives. Yeah, and what is this? Mr. Stewart, is it true that guys like you, you know, mature and all, carry some protection with them for sexual occasion? Oh, What's God. the big deal? Can a girl just do that thing in a book where she adds up the days of her, uh, what do you call it, the mental stration? Oh, that's <laughs> really me. Yeah, and one of the guys said the numbers don't add up right, huh? Yeah! Yeah! yeah it's a yeah. Hey, hey! Yeah.